Hello and welcome back. This is video number five. And in this video, we're going to talk about how to kill two birds with one stone. So this phrase or saying is basically focusing on one thing that will allow you to save time and allow you to essentially achieve the goal of two things, which in this case is social proof. And second of all, engagement. Okay, so we talked briefly about earlier that the social proof aspect is just the likes, right? But it's not just the likes, it's also the content, right? The second thing, which is engagement, can only be achieved if you drive targeted likes or targeted visitors, right? So essentially this video is all about the conversion factor because in the previous video, we talked about how to go about creating content within less than five minutes, which are basically images with quotes on them, right? So how do we create or get images that resonate with your targeted audience? And how do we figure that out? A lot of cases, a lot of times we think, oh, we, we know that we know our audience pretty well, and we'll just pick and choose some images. But that's the wrong mindset to have because just because we think that is the case or we think that's what they would like, it's not always the case. So what you need to do is you need to figure out several different images that might be similar but slightly different. For example, for this fan page, we have a dog, a picture of a dog. We know the demographic is mainly women and these particular women may like dogs. So we have a cute dog here. And then of course, a day without laughter is a day wasted. Nicholas Chamfont. So that's a quote that sort of ties into the cute puppy. So it's saying that you need to laugh every single day. And this looks kind of funny. All right. So that's one image that we could test. Another image that we could test would be something similar, maybe another dog but with a, a different quote. So that's what we did in this case. Now, this was actually just uploaded recently, so you can see it's only got 82 people reached. But this one here is a picture of another dog with some quote that says, kindness is the best key to open the locked door of every heart. So this is a little bit more sentimental. It's not more laughter but we can see that it's got 258 people reached and 11 engagements versus the other one that had no engagements at all. So we haven't even run ads yet, but if we do run ads, then we can test these two up against each other and see what actually converts. Now, in terms of images, what I recommend is whatever your niche is, whatever your market is, Try to test different images, different images ranging from different things that relate directly to the, the product and service that you're selling or things that are unrelated or things that make people laugh, make people feel good inside kind of thing. And just test it out and see which one gets the most engagement. And that's all we're trying to figure out right now, because in terms of setting up the ad campaign, the ad set level, and the ad, that's what I'm going to teach you in the next three videos. So for now, it's just a matter of gathering images that you think would convert. And then by the next three videos, you'll see whether or not they will convert or not based on the tier three country traffic. So that is going to allow us to test images by only spending literally 10, 20, 30, or even $50 versus uh, testing it against a tier one country initially and spending hundreds or even thousands of dollars before you even uh, figure out what actually works. So that's what I want you to do for now is just do that. Now I want you to go to different sites. There's several sites out there that will provide you with these uh, kind of royalty free images. Get Stencil was one of them. Uh, but if you don't see anything that you don't like on Get Stencil, there are actually other sites out there. Okay, so there are two websites that we use for almost the last decade. And uh, the first one is Big Stock Photo. That's bigstockphoto.com, as you can see here. 
this uh, they have really good images and uh, it does cost money obviously another one is called graphicriver.net and if you go here you can actually go to photos and you'll find photos for about two bucks now if you're low on money and you want something for free then there's another site called pixabay.com and you can go there you can sign up and you can find a lot of really good royalty free free images uh, that allow for commercial use and as you can see it looks uh, just as good there's just a more of a limited variety compared to that of like big stock photo or even graphic river so now that you have a idea of what to do which is gather the images want you to pause the video figure that out and then in the next three videos i'm going to show you how to actually set up your ads.